Silicon is used to make electronic devices like phones, tablets and cameras because it is an excellent semiconductor. Semiconductors are solids with distinct electrical features. They have a higher resistance than resistors but still have much lower resistance than solids that do not pass electricity at all, e.g. rubber or wood. The conducting properties of silicon can be altered by a process called doping, which is the intentional and controlled introduction of impurities into the structure of a substance. This is done to lower the substance's resistance and increase its conductivity. Here is a simplified illustration of the process. An important point to remember, electric current is the flow of electrons or charge. Step 1. Remove a silicon atom and replace it with a phosphorus atom. Note also that phosphorus, being a group 5 element, has 5 outer electrons, or while silicon, being a group 4 element, has just 4 outer electrons. This means that there is one more electron to move around. And so, there is more current flow now than there was before, due to the extra electron. I repeat this process and you have even more free electrons to carry charge. The silicon can now be used to make electronic devices 